It's called Balls and Strikes. But actually, since your interview book is going out next week, yes. you're actually the first person that yes. our audiences are hearing this segment. So this is the real test. To yeah. Like we've done it before, but those episodes aren't going out for later. It's called Balls and Strikes. So oh, hang on. Let me interrupt for a second. Vinny, did you sign off on this idea, Balls and Strikes? Yes, it was actually brought to my attention by friends of mine that it'd be a, a fun idea. So I brought it. So down. here's the thing. Like this is this. So this is there's a lot of pressure right now because like this could absolutely suck. And this would be one of those things in like two years, like Vinny will call up Alex and I'm like, Remember when we thought that balls and strikes thing was going to be really good and we did it with that, the redheaded guy, and it stunk. I thought it was going to be good, but it stunk. <laughs> so here we go. All right. So the idea of the game is called balls and strikes. Vinny has been really hard on me about my questions at times, saying that. Pushing Alex to ask better questions. Right. And so I asked a not very good question. And so this is well, where. What was the not very good question? So the question was. Uh, What's one TV show that you love that everyone hates? Okay. And Vinny said that was a terrible question. I just didn't think it was worded very well. It's a very tough question to answer. You mean like on the fly? Oh, on the fly. We were live doing the interview with a, a Cubs prospect. That's hard. So that's a hard question that like that. I think that it, I think as a question, it's fine. I think that that's one of those. It's got to be a little more casual because like, And that's, I mean, hell, I've seen, you know, Jay Billis ask Jay Wright on, you know, in a taped segment, what's your favorite TV show? And Jay Wright totally choked. He was like, I don't know. (laughs) I think if I flipped it the other way, it's one TV show that you hate that everyone loves. I'll give you one. Can I, can I, by the way, just, I need to jump in on this. I'm in the middle of something with my brother right now. So like, I'm a nice enough dude. But I'm, I can be judgy. So, like, and I don't know whether you guys are down with this, but uh, with TV shows, if certain people are telling me the TV show is really good. You're going to hate it. And I think that person's an asshole. So <laughs> it's like my brother's like, you've got to watch The Undoing. And then my friend's like, you've got to watch The Undoing. And then I'm on, like, Instagram and whatever, and these D-bags that I follow to hate follow. I really am revealing too much here. But I'm like, oh, they like the undoing. That show's got to suck. And so my brother's like, you got to watch the undoing. The undoing's good. And I'm like, I'm not doing it. I'm like, I'm not. I, ju- I No. No. Yeah, that Alex will text me and tell me to post on our Instagram page. And the more he texts me about it, the less and less that I want to do it. Just yeah. to fight him. Be like, nope not doing anything yeah go ahead alex all right so balls and strikes what's funny about it is that i connect with both of you on this one (laughs) i I am alex but i'm also Vinny. like i legitimately am like i like i identify i id with alex like i like alex like works hard at this he's kind of tortured about it like he he thinks about it a lot he wants to keep sort of like polishing himself and yeah, and Vinny's kind of a jackass about it. And yep. I respect that because I kind of am you. too. It's fine. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Boo. Well, that's what it's like I said, you know, I, David Ross and I, when we worked together, but the thing I would always say about David Ross on Dancing with the Stars and he's got the smile and all that. And David Ross is hashtag sneaky asshole. Everybody's like, oh, Rossi, he's the nicest guy. No, sneaky asshole. I have a little bit of that. Right. No, no. And Vinny has some of that, too. So I get a text from Vinny the other night, Boo. He goes, how tall are you? And I go, well, I'm the same height as Ken Rosenthal and Bob Costas. <laughs> and, and, and he goes, you're that short? <laughs> and I go, wow. the license does say I'm 5'4". And then he sent me a screenshot of me, like, with my friends on Instagram. He goes, I didn't realize you were this short. <laughs> And I go, I'm calling HR. And then he goes, I am HR. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. Sorry, balls and strikes. Let's go. Can we still do balls and strikes? Yeah. 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 So balls and strikes, the idea is we ask a question. Vinny and I will will go back and forth. We ask a question. You determine if the question is a ball or a strike. 
And the first okay. person to a strikeout wins. Okay. Strike, strike being good question. Bad. Yeah. yeah. I got it. All right. Vinny, do you want to go first or, or should I? Oh, you've won. You've won I, another start. I, won. I just like to say after the conversation that we just had, I am so into this right now. I can't <laughs> even tell you. I mean, like, I like I'm already telling you that we're just I need you to do it fast, but I'm already like at the end of it, I'm gonna be like, let's play again. All right, go <laughs> ahead. Come on, let's go. All right. What would be the worst gift you've ever received? Paul. You can answer it though. Like oh. you can answer the question too. Um but I don't know if that one you should answer because you might offend someone listening. Yeah, I don't want to offend anybody. There, there's something you know what you know the answer. It's not the I don't know. I don't know the yeah, the worst gift. I'm not I don't know. Yeah, I'm uh, not gonna get anywhere good on that. <laughs> out of all the people that you've met, you know, in baseball. Who is the best leader that you've ever seen in person? Ball. I, I like I. I don't like. I'm not there when they're leading, and leadership mm. is not something that really. I, I don't. I, I I get a glimpse, a tr true glimpse at leadership in really small spurts. So even though I I answered that, but like I'm not saying Derek Jeter. So fuck off if you think that's what I was. <laughs> Go ahead, Alex. All right, so I'm behind in the count, one and zero. Oh. I'm gonna go. Yeah, for we both it. are. Yeah, we both are. God, I, I'm gonna go for. Vinny, it. Are you a pitcher or a hitter? I play first base. You got Eric Hosmer's number back there, huh? It's an Eric Hosmer jersey. <laughs> oh, is it? Okay. Yeah. All right, dig it. All right. When was the last time you surprised yourself? Strike. I. There's a lot of good answers on that one, but like I lost 70 pounds last year. I didn't think I could do that. Good for you. I'm so. down 30 this year, Boog. You inspired me. Good. Uh, I like it. Stay That's the course. Awesome. I'm up 10. Um. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So count one and one for me. Um, if you had a warning label attached to you, what would it say? Sneaky asshole. Strike. <laughs> All right. And then the third one. So it's a one-two count here. Yeah. What is the longest you've gone without sleep? Can I say strike, but I'm not sure? Yeah. I, I actually like that question, especially as a guy who's calling games at 430. So I, I will tell so I'll say strike. So what? Vinny's done. Anyway. Uh, so look at that. Here's what I here's what I'll tell you. So I got one of those aura rings. You know what an aura ring is? Yeah. An aura ring. They they were using them down in the uh, I love that I, I, I went like this, like just in case you guys didn't know what a ring was. Um I they 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 measure your they sort of measure your sleep every night and then it also does like your resting heart rate at night. They had them down in the NBA bubble. They gave them to the players um, to take in certain pieces of information for uh, COVID, etc. Anyway, this system needs a lot of sleep. Like I need a lot of sleep. So like I'm somebody. If you give me six hours of sleep, five straight days. And then you let me sleep like just six, like I'm not talking like four, six hours of sleep, five straight days, the sixth day. And you let me sleep. I'm going 10. I just need, I need a lot of sleep and it, the sleep score that they deliver on the aura ring only confirms it's basically, it's like, it's like bonds, like Barry bonds, 1993 Barry Bonds was as good as it gets. And then he took that stuff and went off the charts. Like I am Barry Bonds of sleep. Like I am that good of a sleeper. Wow. If, if you guys kept asking me questions, I have to go, but like for the next 10 minutes, you could keep asking questions. And if I sat here and, and had to like, try to go to sleep, I probably could fall asleep right in the middle of this. It has nothing to do with you guys. I'm just that good at it. All right, before I let you go, I have to ask our most contentious question of the podcast. Do you prefer drinking out of glass or plastic? Uh, 
Oh. Glass of... And it's just that. It's just that. Or you could pick styrofoam, Yeti cup, whatever. No styrofoam. No styrofoam in my life. Uh, I think probably plastic. Mm. Interesting. Interesting answer. Mm-hmm. So I don't... I, like... I'm not a water bottle. I, I, I recycle just cause that's the way I get, I keep track of and get the water into my system. Mm-hmm. And then, Luke, the last question we have for you on the podcast, what in your opinion is the best position in baseball? Uh, it's not first base, Vinny. You got no shot. Yeah, that's just the wrong answer. I mean, just beat it. You're on the wrong end of the defensive spectrum. You're playing tackle the baseball over there. I guess it's like it's. – I'd say it's catcher or shortstop. Interesting. It's catcher or shortstop. It's a good – this is a great place to end the show right now. Just get him out of here. <laughs> he stood up. <laughs> Stood up. We just do it on a daily basis, okay? Um, um, I I thoroughly enjoyed this, you guys. I'm sorry that I I was not more efficient with my answers, but Alex, you you know that this is how I roll. So. <laughs>